Hello everybody, how are you? Scan 3. Today we'll solve the exam of algebra at this year 2022. Session 1. Question number 1. If the linear equation system, kx subtract 5y subtract 2z equals 0, negative x and negative x plus 4y plus kz equals 0, and 2x plus kz plus y equals 0 has an infinity number of solution then one of the value of k equals space he tells us has an infinite number of solution it's meaning the absolute value of a will be equal 0 we can write here absolute value equal 0 power coefficient of x First here k and coefficient of y negative five coefficient of z negative two second equation negative one here four coefficient of y coefficient of z equal k and here two coefficient of x coefficient of y here equal one right one here he replaced k z here with k Okay, and then we can find the result about absolute value of matrix here equal zero. To mind here equals zero, we can write first here k division by cancel vertical and horizontal line here and write one times k equal k and four k. We can doing it by left hand side cancel row and vertical. And drawing 4 times k subtract k it will be 3k 4k subtract by k subtract negative 5 to be positive 5 multiplication by cancel row and column here and negative 1 times k equal negative k 2k it will be negative 2k And negative 2 cancel row and column vertical and row here negative 1 negative 6 negative 8 negative 1 times 1 negative 1 2 times 4 equal 8 will be negative 8 it will be equal 0 then 3k times k it will be 3k power 2 here 4k minus k equal 3k times k equal 3k power 2 and here we have 5 outside negative k plus negative 2k it will be negative 3k mm, negative 2 multiplication by negative 9 it will be equal 0 and here 3k power 2 subtract 3 times 5 equal 15k plus 2 times 9 equal 18 equal 0 and then we can divide it by 3 to sample this equation k power 2 subtract by 5 k plus 18 divided by 3 equals 6 it will be equal 0 and we can factorize it k times k equal k power 2 we want to find two number multiplication about them equal 6 and if we eat them the result will be 5 we can write 2 and 3 2 times 3 equals 6 and the sign here such as that the middle term negative so k will be equal to or k will be equal to 3 he tell us the one of the value of k we must choose letter p k equal 3 question number 2 if z is a complex number where z equal i power 22 plus i power 24 and subtract 13 then transgeometric the transgeometric form of the number z could be equal space first we must simply z here z equal this complex number i power 22 plus i power 24 n subtract by 30 okay we know i power 24 equal 1 then we can sample list i power 22 the last number can divide it by 4 equal 20 
then 20 can divide it by 4 so we can simply list i by 22 to i power 2 and i power 24 and subtract by 13 we can simply say it will be i power negative 13 and this number i power negative 13 we can simply list it we know i power 2 equal negative 1 and here it will be i power negative 13 we must multiplication it by any number can divide it by 4 the power here divided by 4 subtract just after uh, 13 14 15 16 16 can divide it by 4 because i power 16 equal 1 then we can write z equal negative 1 plus i power 16 plus negative 13 equal 3 and i power 3 equal what equal negative i we can write it negative 1 and negative i it is a z okay the simplest form about z equal negative 1 subtract by i and then we must find r equal what we can find square root about it. x power 2 it will be negative 1 power 2 equal 1 and negative 1 power 2 equal 1 the, re the result will be root 2 about r and we know tan theta equal z over or y over x negative 1 over by negative 1 it will be 1 and angle here lies in the third quadrant here about theta it will be 45 it will be by over 4 lies in the third it's meaning theta will be 180 plus 45 will be 5 plus 0 equal 5 4 plus 8 equal 12 to and carry up 1 it will be 225 and we must assemble this angle theta will be 360 subtract by 225 10 minus 5 equal 5 5 minus 2 equal 3 and 3 minus 2 equal 1 and write negative outside okay you must add negative 360 to 225 the result will be negative 135 we must convert this angle by by number here divided uh, by 180 convert from degree here to radian it will be negative right by 135 divided by 180 equal 3 over 4 the theta so we can write z in the simplest form about algebra write r first root 2 multiplication by cosine negative 3 over 4 pi plus i multiplication by sine this angle negative 3 over 4 of pi shows letter b this is the result about question number two question number three if the two straight line L1 and L2 are perpendicular, then M equal. We know two straight line perpendicular, it's meaning D1, vector D1, multiplication by vector D2 equal 0. We can find D1, vector 1 equal here, 2, and here we can change the sign because Y equal negative. The sign about y negative we must change the sign here okay two and three and four and so we must change the sign here about z z will be positive because it was negative it must be positive z positive y positive x we must change the sign here in the base it will be three and four right here two and three and four two and three three and four it's about vector one vector two here three four and m we must change the sign here about z it must be convert to positive okay it will be positive z by multiplication negative numerator and numerator so vector d2 equal here three and four and m and we must doing this rule here d1 multiplication by d2 equal 0 2 and 3 and 4 dot 
3 and 4 and m multiplication wins m result will be 0 2 times 3 equals 6 3 times 4 equal 12 4 times 5 equal 4 m 4 times m equal 4 m it will be equal 0 18 divided by 4 can move it to the left hand side it will be negative 18 divided by 4 then m will be equal negative 1 divided by 2 it will be negative 4.5 choose letter e about question number 3 question 4 the sum of the coefficients of the two middle terms in the expansion 2 over x plus x power 2 over 2 all power 25 equals base he tell me the sum of the coefficient of two terms in the middle two middle terms we know we have here in this expansion 2 over x plus x power 2 over 2 all power 25 we have to 26 term here in this expansion number of term here equal 26 so we can find the middle we can find the middle term here the middle terms here will be equal what we can divide it by 2 26 divided by 2 equal 13 and write the term come after 13 it will be 14 so we have two term in the middle because the number of all term here equal 26 so we can write term 13 equal 25 combination 12 write the second here x power 2 over 2 we can find the coefficient we must find the coefficient put x equal 1 here and x equal 1 okay and write the second 1 power 2 over 2 it will be half power what 1 over 2 power 12 multiplication by first 2 over 1 it will be 2 power what's the difference between 25 and 12 it will be 13 and we can sample it this right 25 combination 12 2 power it will be 2 power negative 12 multiplication 2 power 13 it will be 2 power negative 12 plus 13 equal 1 so it's the coefficient of term 30 the result will be 25 combination 12 and we won't find the next term term 14 we can write 25 combination what combination 13 write the second here 1 over 2 because we can find the coefficient and here we want to find the coefficient of term 13 and term 14 write the second here power 13 multiplication the first 2 divided by 1 it will be 2 over uh, what uh, 2 over 1 equal to power what uh, 13 and 25 we must find the difference between them it will be what 25 minus 13 equal to 12 and then we can change it and write 2 power negative 13 and write 25 combination by 13 2 power negative 13 times 2 power 12 it will be 2 power negative 1 and then he want to find the sum of two coefficient term 13 and term 14 we can find the sum we can add them 25 combination 12 times 2 plus 25 combination 13 multiplication by 2 power negative 1 it will be half we know 25 combination 12 is equality of 25 coefficient 13 zero equality because we can sample this combination here 25 minus 13 equal 12 so zero equality we can write here 12 here you can change 13 to be 12 because 25 combination 13 equal 25 combination 12 
so we can change it here and then we can write the head cone factor between them 25 combination by 12 outside here the sum between two and half it will be five over two we can find the sum between them five over two two plus half five over two so we must change here or choose what look at here where five over two outside here 25 combination 12 yes it's the result or you can change uh, 12 to be 13 if the teacher change the result it will be equality okay so we must choose letter c about this question letter c choose letter c about question number four in the opposite figure question number five abc is triangle in which de barely two cp and matrix x equal one two three a d a e d e a b a c b c then the matrix x is space matrix we want to find the matrix the type of matrix here non-singular or singular we must know if they determined about this uh, matrix equals zero then matrix x will be singular non-singular if the matrix uh, determine about matrix is not equal to zero so we must find determine about x here we have space what to cut here this triangle we know this property is about triangle we have symmetry between the small triangle and the longest triangle here aed and triangle acp we have similar between the small triangle and the longest triangle so we can find the ratio between all similar so let's see here ee -E, the ratio between ee -E over ac equal ad because it's parallel ed parallel to cp in the triangle aed similar to acp in the ratio between ed and ab equal e d over c p okay we write the ratio between corresponding sides here into a triangle then we can write here unknown outside here m then we can write a e will be equal m multiplication by a c and a d a b times m okay and e d will be equal m multiplication by cp then we must find the matrix about x here okay write the matrix here cancel write one and two and three first and cancel uh, what here ed we cancel ad and write m ab and cancel ee and write m ac and cancel PC DE and write M C B and write here E B A C B C or C B. We can write M outside coefficient outside here. M. Okay, and we have two row equality. Then the value about this determined here will be equal zero zero times equal zero then determined or power matrix x will be zero then this matrix will be singular singular okay choose letter b about this question this matrix singular question six the measure of the angle between two plane equals base we have two plane here two planes x plus y plus 2z equals 7 and second here r dot 2 and negative 1 and 1 equal negative equal what equal 6 okay we can find the vector about plane 1 and plane 2 it's plane 1 we can find the vector u here coefficient of x coefficient of y coefficient of z 
and here we can vector u 2 and the negative 1 and 1 okay we can find angle between two plane here by using this rule cosine theta equal vector 1 and vector 2 here dot vector 1 dot vector 2 over square root of vector 1 or magnitude right magnitude here first right the rule first step and second step I will find the result okay magnitude about vector 1 multiplication magnitude about vector 2 then cosine theta will be equal 1 times 2 equal 2 1 times negative 1 equal negative 1 2 times 1 equal 2 okay and here square root about 1 power 2 plus 1 power 2 plus 2 power 2 2 power 2 equal 4 negative 1 power 2 equal 1 1 power 2 equal 1 and then cosine theta equal 2 minus 1 equal 1 1 plus 2 equal 3 and here 9 3 times 3 4 5 5 plus 1 equal 6 and here 4 plus 1 5 plus 1 equal 6 it will be 3 over 6 it will be half then theta equal 60 shift the cosine of half the result will be 60 the angle will be 60 letter c question number seven the equation of the plane which passes through the center of the sphere and contains a straight line whose equation cx over 3 y minus 1 over 4 z plus 2 over 2 is space okay we have here sphere we want to find the equation about the plane which passes through the center about the sphere and contain of straight line straight line here x over 3 it's l okay equation about straight line l such that x over 3 equal y minus 1 over 4 equal z plus 2 over 2 we can write the vector about l here equal 3 and 4 and 2 and we have point this point I will put it here a this point I will put it a here okay we can find the point here x subtract by 0 right 0 y subtract by 1 z subtract by negative 2 it's a point okay we get the point lies on the straight line and the vector about this straight line okay okay and then we can find the center about the circle because they give us in this example the equation of the circle equal x plus 1 all power 2 plus y minus 1 power 2 plus z power 2 equal r power 2 he give us this equation okay my students understood okay we can find here the center of the circle negative 1 negative negative 1 will be a positive and 0 so we can find the length about AM right AM the line segment AM we have M and A we must find the length AM here 0 minus minus 1 equal 1 1 minus 1 equal 0 negative 2 minus 0 equal negative 2 okay we have what em here and we have the vector u here why we do it because we won't find what the vector u or n we won't find the vector n vector n we can get it by cross about it vector em cross vector what vector u vector em and vector u here we can find the cross between them to find the vector n it's perpendicular to a straight line and perpendicular to the plane and perpendicular to the sphere okay then we can find in here cross between 
two vectors here right x and y and z or i and j and k and write em first em here one and zero and negative two and vector u equal three and four and two we can find the result here by using calculator or thinking about steps here can cancel i and write two zero here times zero negative eight it will be eight and j cancel row and column here to subtract it will be plus uh, six it will be eight and the right negative outside it will be negative eight and k cancel row and column one times four equal four minus zero it will be four okay we can find the vector n then we can write the equation about the plane here such as that n vector n dot r equal n dot the point here a point a then we can write n here 8 and negative 8 and 4 dot x and y and z equal n 8 and negative 8 and 4 dot a 0 and 1 and negative 2 and then we can sample this equation right here the result will be 8x negative 8y plus 4z equal 8 times 0 equal 0 and negative 8 times 1 equal negative 8 4 times negative 2 equal negative 8 then 8x subtract 8y plus 4z equal negative 16 and you can sample it look at the result here we can divide it by 4 to simplest it it will 2x negative 2y plus z equal negative 4 okay look at the result here negative 2x here minus y plus z plus it will be plus okay plus 4 2x minus 2y plus z plus 4 equals 0 join this negative will be positive and write 0 shows letter d understood question 8 a company has 10 men and 5 women then the number of ways to select a commit of 5 persons such that the number of women is prime number number of women prime number we know prime number equal what two prime number two and three and five and seven but we have here in the example five women and ten men okay we can choose what about women five combination by five or combination here we must find the uh, result or the remainder by the men if you choose five women you will choose zero men and if you change or choose three women you must choose from ten men the remainder the remainder will be two because two plus five equal three plus two plus three equal five you want five choose five five persons or five combination three or ten combination two and we can write five combination two women or ten combination by what two plus three equal five okay it's a result you can use a calculator to find the result it will be 1651 okay choose letter d question 9 
is expansion 1 over x plus k x power 2 or power 8 according to the ascending powers of x there is a coefficient of x power 7 equal 57 then k equal we must find the rule here about expansion 1 over x we have here 1 over x plus k x power 2 all power 8 we want to find the coefficient of x power 7 okay we know the general term tr plus 1 equal 8 combination by r multiplication by the second k x power 2 power the base here r multiplication the first 1 over x multiplication the difference between 8 and r okay okay we can simplify it here 8 combination r multiplication k power r multiplication x power 2r multiplication by here x power negative 8 plus r and then you can simply it at a coefficient combination r multiplication k power r multiplication x power 2r and r 3r minus 8 and we must choose what we tell us in this example the coefficient is power 7 equal 56 then you can write x power 7 will be equal x power 3r minus 8 to know r equal space r equal what we know base equal base then the power equals the power then 7 will be equal 3r minus 8 and 3r will be equal 7 plus 8 equal 15 divided by 3 then r equal 5 then term here will be 6 the term 6 okay term 6 here equal what equal we got the power coefficient equal 56 then coefficient will be what then coefficient of term 6 it tell us the result will be 56 okay put here in this coefficient r equal 5 it will be equal 8 coefficient 5 multiplication by k power 5 understood i put r here equal 5 because it tells us the coefficient of term 6 equal 56 okay we can solve this equation to find the k we know 8 combination by 5 equal 56 so we can cancel it divided by it it will be k power 5 equal 1 then k will be equal 1 understood because 8 combination 5 equal 56 56 divided by 56 equal 1 then k power 5 equal 1 so k will be equal 1 choose letter d question 9 in the expansion 1 over x plus k over 2 okay the result will be 1 look at question number 10 in the ratio between the fourth term from the beginning in the fourth term from the end expansion a over x plus x over a or power 2n equal a power 4 to x power 4 the n equal what where x pulling to r stars and a burning to r star okay look at here he uh, tell us the ratio between two forces from beginning and the end okay the ratio between forces from beginning and the force from the end equal what a power 4 over x power 4 okay we must find the term force first term from the beginning in this expansion here we can write what the force it will be write the power here 2n combination by 3 okay 2n combination by 3 multiplication by the second x over a power 3 multiplication the first a over x power the difference between 2n and 3 okay and term from the end we must replacing two term here understood In space we must find the fourth term from the end you must change to term replace it replace it two term here right 2n combination by 3 and right here the combination will be what if you change uh, two term here 
the result will be x or the explanation will be x over a plus e over x uh, all power 2n okay it change the height right in the second here o over x power 3 multiplication by the first x over a power the difference between them 2n minus 3 all equal e power 4 x power 4 you can sample state here two base equality and here two base equality and to in combination 3 and combination 3 we can cancel them by us and right here we can sample this at right here x over a power 3 and here x over a 2n minus 3 right negative 2n plus 3 and e over x 2n minus 3 subtract by 3 it will be e power 4 over x power 4 and here the result will be x over a or power 2 3 plus 3 equals 6 minus 2n multiplication by a over x all power 2n minus 6 equal a power 4 x power 4 we can replace this in right a over x like a over x here okay right a over x power negative 6 plus 2n and we must eat because this piece quality this piece we must eat the power right 2n negative 6 will be e power 4 over x power 4 then e over x power 2n plus 2n equal 4n negative 6 and negative 6 negative 12 equal e over x all power 4 we have two base equality here then base equal base in power equal power then 4n minus 12 equal 4 then 4n will be equal 16 divided by 4 then n will be 4 choose letter b question 11 if n minus 1 combination r plus 1 equal n combination r subtract n minus 1 combination by r you won't find n okay we must simply replace n minus 1 combination r to left hand side then n minus 1 combination r plus 1 plus n minus 1 combination r it will be n combination by r we have n minus 1 equality n minus 1 and r plus 1 and r we must choose what it choose the greatest and it one to the top here it one to the top it will be n combination by r plus 1 it will be n combination by r we know n equality n then r plus 1 equal r or we can write n equal r plus 1 plus r then n equal to r plus 1 and it's false so n equal to r plus 1 the result will be letter a choose letter a about this example question 12 if two planes are parallel then n multiplication m equal space we know two parallel two planes parallel parallel it's meaning what it's meaning the ratio between first we know vector one equal look at here one and m and 16 and vector two about second plane coefficient of x here l and two and eight the ratio between one over l equal m over 2 m over 2 then l multiplication by m cross the product of streams equals the product of means here equal to then l multiplication m equal 2 choose letter b question 13 a thread line which path through point 2 to 8 and its direction vector 3 1 4 cuts x axis at point space okay we can write the equation about straight line which passing through the point and direction vector 3 and 1 and 4 okay x subtract by 2 
y subtract by 2 z subtract by 8 over 3 and 1 and 4 he tell us cuts is x axis at point we know if the straight line cuts x axis it's meaning uh, z and y equal 0 okay so we must x right x and 0 and 0 because the straight line cuts x axis straight line cuts x axis at this point okay put this point as a straight line then x over minus 2 over 3 equal 0 minus 2 equal negative 2 because we must put y equal 0 and z equal 0 here we can find x by cross x minus 2 equal negative 6 then x will be negative 4 then the point will be negative 4 and 0 and 0 choose the a question 14 if a and b and c and e vector are four vectors in the simple line and vector c equal vector a plus vector b and vector e equal vector a minus vector b if vector c cross vector e equal three in direction e where e is perpendicular unit vector to the plane containing the vectors a b c and d and then uh, vector a cross vector b okay we want to find vector a cross vector b look at this information he tell us uh, vector c cross vector e equal three we can find this properties in the first step such that vector c cross vector e equal three vector e vector c give us uh, vector a plus vector b cross vector e equal uh, e vector a minus vector b equal uh, three in direction e e cross e we know it will be zero okay right e times cross e and vector e cross negative here it will be negative here negative vector b okay and b vector cross vector a and b right negative b cross b in direction e equal 3e direction e then we know it's zero and it's zero and negative ab vector e cross b and here we can change it will be negative a replace this m a vector b equal 3 because direction is the same direction then negative 2 vector a cross vector b we add them equal 3 divided by negative 2 then vector a cross vector b equal negative 3 over 2 in the direction e okay in direction e here choose what choose e question 15 a vector if a 3 2 5 is a point in the space in a space it's a projection on xy plane is point p and its projection on xz plane is point c then bc vector space okay we want to find bc give us e and point b on xy plane okay we look at here we have here x and y and z we have the point 3 and 2 and 5 3 and 2 and 5 here is the projection about this point in what in xy here the point will be p 
is point to be in x y x y it's meaning z will be equal to zero when we write three two and zero and the projection about this point three two five in x z here is c the projection here about this point about x and z y will be equal to zero and write three and five then we can find the lengths about c and b or he won't find vector pc it's meaning vector c subtract vector p c and b find the difference between them three minus three equals zero two minus two equal negative two and five minus zero equal five the result will be zero and negative two and five it will be negative two okay I J K okay right first J and K I equals zero J K choose that are C 